We have just been into the NBA exhibition and it was pretty good. There was so much to do. Otto, did you like it? Yep. Maya? Oscar, did you like it? Yeah. It was pretty cool. There was lots to do. Um, and now we're on to our next adventure. What do you do when no one's in the elevator? You dance. You dance. Oh. <laughs> that was short-lived dance. I think we're on the right floor. Are we on M? Yep, we're on, I think we're on M. Um, we are heading back to the car. <laughs> and we were going to do our next stop at the confectionery place, but our next stop is Costco. at Costco and we have done our little mini shop and we have got yeah, I pizza. Know. Oh, it's got pizza, it's got a burger, may has got a soda, Fanta, sun kissed. Um, yeah but we're gonna have our lunch, late lunch because it's quarter to three um, and then we'll head to <laughs> then we'll head to the confectionery place. We have reached our Next destination.
I remember having these as a kid and loving them. Um, yeah, but I didn't get one, but it brought back great childhood memories. Now that we are home, I thought I would just show you what um, Oscar got in his claw machine. Um, I don't actually know if he's taken anything out of this or not, but let's have a look what he got in here. Watermelon slices. Marshmallow eggs. Uh, these. Tom's sweets, I don't know what they are. Um, green apple mint candy sticks. He got a Easter egg. And two more things in there. Chewy candy sours by two. We are home from our day out in Melbourne and I'm keen to get my pyjamas on, that's for sure. But everything we did, we had so much fun at. The NBA exhibition was fantastic. Highly recommend going. Um, Costco, 
if you've been to Costco, then if you know, you know. Um, and the Tom's Confectionery Warehouse is um, fun. It is a pricey, but all those candy type stores are pricey. Um, Oscar and Maya had fun in the, the human claw machine. Otto wasn't old enough, tall enough, or heavy enough to go in there. So it's eight years of age, 110-ish. He was borderline height, but you had to be 30 kilos, which Otto is not. So um, yeah, he couldn't go on it, but he got to ride the dinosaur. Yeah. Anyway, we might go back another time and then Otto um, will be able to do it. Um, yeah, pricey. There were some things in there that were reasonably priced, but um, yeah, if you, you'll see some of the prices that I listed, but you know, if you're going to take a trip there, just be prepared for that. Um, just set a budget for your kids. Um, that's all I would recommend. But yeah, we um, had a long trip home because traffic was a bumper to a bumper the whole way home. But Thanks for joining us on our <laughs> day out. And um, yeah, let me know if you have been to any of those places um, and what you thought of them or if you're gonna go. Thanks for watching, bye.